Hello and welcome to another edition of my collection. This time it's time for the Atari! Maybe you heard of this great company. First I want to show you something that is maybe interesting for people who doesn't know it. This is a typical Atari 2600 module. This thing, fella, is the big one. 5200. This is once again the same type as the 200. 2600. This is the 7800. This is a Jaguar module and this is an Atari Lynx module. The handheld, the famous handheld where you can hit people with it like, the, like it's a brick. So, this time, just for your record, I have two consoles in this category. I also got Jaguar, but uh, this is the 2600 Junior console and this is the 7800 who plays also 2600 games. So, we start with the models. You are maybe impressed. My collection is not so huge, but a lot of people want to see it, so here it is. Start with Jazz Revenge. Jazz Revenge is a classic. You're an insect and uh, in this space shooter uh, you have to shoot through walls and attack uh, an offender and shoot the walls down. It's absolutely fun and it's absolutely great. It's a classic. You have to play it. Also a great classic is Dick Duck. Dick Duck on the Atari 2600 is maybe not the best version, of course, but it's really good. If you have a chance to get it, it's worth it. You have to, you see it, you have to uh, use air to uh, blow enemies into pieces. It's really good, it's a really great game, good thing. One of my favorites is Dragonfire. Um, you are an adventurer to get uh, treasures from a dragon and you have to uh, jump or duck uh, fireballs. It's really, really great. It has two screens. Great game. A must have. Circus Atari is nice. Um, you jump on a well, uh, should I say, uh, and you have to get balloons. It's okay, it's very decent, it's okay, it's not the, it, it's not, um, no, no, maybe on the other side, it's, it's really great. Um, it's okay, um, I love this game and it's, it's really okay, it's really nice. You see the very important use with pedal controllers. I don't have pedal controllers if you're interested in this. I have a normal joystick. This is Mega Mania. This is a nice space shooter. It's a really nice game. It's not the greatest game on earth, but it's it's okay. It's it's a nice shooter. It's worth it. Super Breakout. Uh, also with pedal controllers. It's Breakout and this version is a little bit enhanced, so it's Super Breakout. So you have to break walls. Out. Great game. <laughs> really great game. A little bit easy, a little bit standard, but it's really, really cool. The first German top title, Bobby geht heim. I think uh, Bobby's going home or... Bobby go, goes home. It's the translation. I think the, the world or the English title is it. Um, it's a nice game. You are Bobby, of course, and you have to go home with a little bit jumping uh, about uh, rivers, bridges. It's it's really interesting. It's cool. One of the greatest games of all time in arcades, Moon Patrol. The Atari 2600 version is not the best, of course, but Moon Patrol is still awesome. You are a moon buggy on a moon, of course, and uh, where a lot of invaders and 
holes and uh, other obstacles. This is huge. This is a classic. Cosmic Arc, one of my favorite games from the past. Also a two-screener. Um, it's maybe the first ever um, sequel to Atlantis. Atlantis is also in my collection. In Cosmic Arc you control an arc, of course, a cosmic arc. Well, what a surprise. And this arc has to shoot uh, comets and when go to uh, the landing scene have to capture animals or maybe beings. Who knows? Just a cosmic arc, of course. It's very good, it's very addictive, it's a must-have. Frogger! Frogger is still awesome on any platform. This Atari 2600 version is also really nice, so if you have a chance to get it, it's worth it, believe me. <laughs> what a coincidence. The next thing is Qbert. Qbert is an absolutely weird game, but it's absolutely a must-have about the cubes and the colors. It's absolutely gigantic. I love it to death. Great game. Ah, oh, the next classic, Pull Position. Awesome racer for its time. Very good, very great. Where is nothing I can tell about why you don't get it. It's good. It's simply good. Activision Decathlon. The first, uh, maybe the first uh, sports compilation. This is just Decathlon, the, the 10 events, of course. 100 meter dash, long jump, shot put, uh, high jump, 400 meters, 110 meters, hurdles. Uh, discus, I think. The next one, pole fold, javelin, and 1,500 meters. I think it's maybe it was the right. Um, it's that great. I love it. I love it today on any system. Decathlon is great, and this is absolutely a great game. If you get a chance, get it. Joust, also a classic. You are on a, is it a horse, is it a Pegasus, who knows, and you have to hit people from above to uh, knock them down. Yeah, sounds crazy. Maybe it is. Uh, but Joust is very great classic, very cool game. It's very, very good. Ah, oh, the next one, Santipede. Ah, uh, you have to kill a centipede, not a millipede, that's, a, that's the sequel. And you can shoot it, you can. Uh, you have to avoid some mushrooms. It's a great shooter, it's very basic, but it's absolutely goddamn addictive. Believe me, you will love it. Ah, oh, another classic. Keystone Capers. Um, the game was based on the black white um, series I think from the from the 20s maybe um, you're a little Bobby and you have to get um, gangsters maybe the prehistoric GTA in this uh, malls and uh, it's really really great um, believe me this is really funny and it's very addictive uh, you go to elevators, um, you have to avoid balls, radios, of course you know the mean radios. <laughs> it's crazy. Um, but it's really good game. But really good. Ah, still a classic. Atlantis. Very good on any system. You have to protect, of course you can get it, Atlantis, with a little bit of um, turrets and uh, have to shoot the uh, invaders, the invaders. Um, it's really, really good. It's a classic, it's worth it. Believe me, you have to get it. And I think now we're on the 10 minute mark again. 
So this is also a second parter. Uh, or a two-parter, not a second parter, a two-parter. Um, so, please rate, subscribe, comment, what do you want? And we we'll see you in the next video. Part two is coming next. Bye-bye.